Hi, I will present you the paper Towards Increasing of STEAM Women Professionals by Implementing Projects that Reduce the Gender Gap, a Study Case in Universidad de Guadalajara. This is Sulema Torres, and they are my colleagues. Globally, only 35% of STEAM students in higher education are women. In order to reduce this gender gap, many organizations and projects have been focused on providing encouragement and role models to women. Higher education institutions play a key role for defining gender equality actions plans, focus on attraction processes for young girls, and access, retention, and guidance in STEAM programs. The Center for Exact Science and Engineering, CUSEI, of the Universidad de Guadalajara has been focused on implementing strategies of attraction and dissemination of STEM-related degree programs in order to increase the number of women that choose to study one of them. There are three programs that promote science and gender equality in education in CUSEI, Science for Girls and Boys, Technovation Girls, and WSTEAM Project. Regarding to Science for Girls and Boys, the program is focused on showing children that science is fun and reachable with simple but illustrative experiments conducted by actual researchers, the role of science in nature and the careers that are related to. The other program is Technovation Girls, which is a global competition where girls teams between 10 to 18 years old, guided by mentors, choose a problem of their community and propose a solution using technology specifically mobile apps. CUSEI participates as a chapter in this program implementing different activities for preparing its teams for the competition, such as workshops about programming, business model, and pitch, among others. Finally, the WSTEAM project aims to improve strategies and mechanisms of attraction, access, and guidance of women in Latin American higher education STEAM programs, and the Universidad de Guadalajara has been collaborating with this project. CUSEI has implemented activities such as the collection of videos of many women's work experiences in order to reinforce girls' role models in STEAM areas, as well as attraction and orientation webinars, among others. Until now, 32 annual events have been carried out, reaching around 9,000 attendees, of which 55% are girls and teenagers. In order to measure the impact of such programs, we analyze the change in the enrollment rates at CUSEI's STEM careers. Our analysis has three samples on different periods of time. 2009, because since there it is possible to know the enrollment by gender. 2013, because since there the programs of attraction has been implemented. And 2019. Based on the enrollment statistics in CUSEI, it can be observed three main behaviors. First, A careers that have increased the female enrollment. We consider that this behavior could be due to the attraction programs implemented because from 2009 to 2013, the careers have had a gradual or low increase and from 2013 to 2019, the enrollment of women show a high increase. Also, we have three undergraduate programs that have decreased the number of women gradually from 2009 until now. This behavior is interesting because even when one of the programs implemented in CUSEI is focused on technology, the number of women in related careers has not increased. Finally, there are three careers that used to have higher number of women than men. It is interesting to observe that the number of women in chemistry career decreases. This result is consistent with other studies in the state of the art, where mentioned that careers considered as disciplines geared towards women may experience a fly of women who move to other areas. Considering the general increase of women in CUSEI's undergraduate programs, we considered that programs like Science for Girls and Boys, Technovation Girls, and WSTEAM have had a good impact on girls. However, there is still work to do. It is necessary to establish monitoring activities for the beneficiaries of the programs and also review the programs in order to not only increase the women enrollment, but also keep the percentage in careers with a high number of women enrollment. Thank you for your attention and this is the contact email.